Hey everyone, Wednesday in the Word with Wes. Uh, we've got our uh, concrete poured here into the forms at the church, but there is a great temptation right now, and that is to uh, write my initials in this while it's still wet, or to, uh, to walk and leave some footprints. I remember when I was running in high school one time, I was running along and there was no pylons, there was no markers, I just ran right into some wet cement and, and uh, put my footprints all the way through it and they had to come back the next day and fix the mess that I had made. And yet, uh, if somebody had come along once that cement dried, they would easily have been able to see where I walked and to put their feet right where I had stood uh, because they would I would have left footprints in that wet cement. And it, it, this uh, is kind of what we're supposed to do as believers with Jesus. In 1 Peter chapter 2, verse 21, it says, To this you were called, because Christ suffered for you, leaving you an example that you should follow in his steps. And so what we are to do is we are to endure suffering because we're following in the footsteps of Jesus. Uh, when God calls us to follow him, he doesn't promise that, that life is all of a sudden going to be easy and happy every moment. Uh, Jesus suffered. He went to the cross and he died unjustly. And uh, he says that we as his followers are to expect the same treatment and uh, we are to to walk that same path if anyone would come after me he must deny himself take up his cross and follow me is what jesus says and so i want to pray for us today that uh, as we struggle as we endure challenges as we experience suffering that god would be with us god i pray that uh, you would encourage those who are hurting today that you would let us know that your son went before us and may we fix our eyes on him May we depend on him, may we trust in him, and uh, God, may we see his steps and uh, follow uh, in them, we pray in Jesus' name.